Welcome back. Now what we need to do is that we need to fill the products table with some with some data with with some uh, products. Uh, however, uh, it's gonna take time if you want to fill that manually using the insert. You can you click on insert, and then you can manually insert the products. However, however, this is gonna take time, so I'm gonna be using SQL. And I have this command. I'm gonna paste it, and and I'm gonna walk you through this command. So this command is going to insert a product into the product table, and what's going to insert is is that's going to insert the product name, category, description, image, image two, image three, image four, price, special offer, and color. So the first thing that we need to specify is the name of the product. Here, uh, I I um, I'm get, I'm adding here white shoes. The second thing that we need to fill is the category. The category is shoes. The third is the description. Here I said awesome white shoes. And then the, the fourth column is product image. So the product Im image is very important. You need to type the name of the image that you have in your project. So if you have a, 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 an image that you have added you, uh, in your project called featured one, for example, that JPEG, you need to, to, to name that image here. You need to pass that image here whenever you are adding a new product. The, the product image 2 and 3 and 4 are different uh, images that belong to the same product. So for example, if you want to take uh, different images for the same product from other uh, sides to show the user uh, all sides of the product, you can here specify these. But for the sake of, of simplicity, I'm gonna just pass the same exact image for image two, three, and four. And then we have the product uh, price. The price is here 155. And then the product special offer. The special offer is going to be a number. So if zero, it means that this product uh, is not that uh, there is no sale on this product and there is no special offer. So zero, it means nothing. If you want, for example, 30% uh, discount, you can here say 30. But I'm going to say zero because there is no special offer. The last column is color. So the color is white. And then you can just click on go, and this is going to insert the first. Uh, this is going to insert the first uh, product. Now if I click on PHP project and now if I go to the products uh, table I should find one product. As you can see I have now one product. Why choose? And you can repeat the same thing you just need to, to click on SQL and then type the same exact command but you need to change data. You need to change of course the product name, category, description, image, uh, price, sp special offer and color. And again, the image is important. You need to make sure that you have this image in your project, and you need to make sure that the image here matches the one, matches the name of the image that you have in your, uh, in your project. And um, as for the ID, the ID of the product will be given automatically. So, for example, here, if you insert a new product into the product table, you'll find that the ID will increase uh, automatically by the database. So, don't worry about the ID. The ID will be given to the to each product you insert uh, automatically, which is awesome because you don't have to worry the, uh, about the product ID. And the product ID, of course, is very important because the product ID is the only thing that is unique. Because you could have uh, two products that have the same uh, name, but the the ID must be different.